Brooks Brooks is having a good start offensively with him in there. Um, you know, I don't know if it's you know one player or anything like that. I think it's just us as a whole. We didn't start fast, and when you do that and you play a good team like South Carolina, you dig yourself in a hole. So we as a group, you know, offense, defense, special teams, we all have to start fast. Er. Elijah, at any point today, did you feel like you guys were all the way back into it, or just close to getting back into it at times? Um, it varied. I felt like we, we came flat. We didn't start fast. I feel like everybody knows that. And, um, you know, I, I feel like during there were times during the game where we got things going and we got drives going. I mean, we were able to put some points up on the board, but the consistency is a big thing. Um, I feel like if we, if we keep our foot on the gas, you know, the only people that can stop us is us. And, um, you know, shouts out to South Carolina. They're a good football team. But, um, you know, we just have to be better. Kyle, how much did the pressure bother you? And were you, I don't mean just you, but I mean the offense in terms of maybe guys not finishing off routes and just disrupting the timing of, of everything. You know, um, you know, I'm not sure. I'd have to look at the tape. But I think uh, South Carolina you know, did a good job on defense. Um, but we have to do that on offense. <laughs> Kind of frustrating. Defense gets three turnovers today, and you don't turn any of them into points. I think we did. We did turn one into the points. One, uh, the, the interception you did? My bad. Derek said you didn't. I didn't check it. <laughs> Kyle, what, okay. what was missing in, in the run game overall, you think? Um, I'm not sure. Uh, you know, I think there was some good runs in there. Um, but I think it's just as a group, um, you know, offense as a whole, we got to be better. You know, we talk about the run setting up the pass and the pass softening up to where we can run downhill. So I think, you know, both the you know the running game and the passing game, we really gotta take a look at and see what we can do to be both, you know, better in both. What can you do that look like a few uh, exchanges between you and the center or snaps just either low or drop and mishandle or whatever? You know, I think um, <laughs> that was after the delay and I think those uh you know it's just a wet ball. Um, you know, we did you know have more practice all week, so we didn't really have to worry about you know a wet ball drill. But you know, I just came up. We just got to be able to you know have a little mental agility and do a better job of you know QB center exchange. Well, I think you guys switched centers at that time too. Was there how much of you two you and Bruno worked on exchanges in practice like in the last couple of weeks? Yeah, I mean we we work with all you know three of our centers. I mean, all quarterbacks work with every center, so. Elijah, was the delay helpful? Did it come a good time, bad time? Did you think what 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 you guys do during that time? Um, didn't really do much. The rain kind of held it, held everything up. Uh, I say coming back <coughs> out after the rain delay, it was it was a bit hard because it it seemed like everybody had to get get back going and I'm able to do that. Uh, I felt like after the second second quarter into going into half before the rain delay. We had got some got some jobs going, even if they didn't turn into points. But um, it, we, we kind of got rolling, and then the rain delay happened, and that just it's a roadblock. But you know we have to be able to to come back after that, and like Kyle said, have the mental agility to navigate that, and uh, you know, and get going. One two more questions, Elijah. Uh, Coach Mason said he 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 emphasize that this was a team loss, no, no finger pointing, anything like that. Did you guys talk about it all among the among the players to kind of take this as a team loss? Yeah, it's a team loss. We didn't score enough points. They scored too many points on us. Um, all these decent special teams all the way around. We didn't play well enough. Um, that's not up to our potential. Um, you know, we're as a, as a team and, you know, amongst the players, we'll continue to talk, you know, and hash things out. As long as we, you know, as long as, you know, I guess Coach Mason says, I, I think it's good. You know, you, the only way you can break a fist is from the outside part of the thing. So as long as you stay together, I feel like we'll be able to move forward and, uh, and keep keep things cohesive. One more question. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you so much.